guys, welcome to Appalachia's Homestead. Patera with you tonight. We are at Tennessee Wesleyan College in Athens, Tennessee. We are with the Tennessee Trail of Tears Association. Tonight is our symposium. We have two incredible speakers. So we look forward to bringing you footage and pictures and whatnots from this important event tonight. We hope you come out. We expect a lot of beautiful faces, so come along. statues up in Nakatula Garden and uh, a state uh, placard up there that explains the story. All right, right here with me. Are you ready? One, two, three. We are honored to have him here. Give him a big Tennessee welcome, Mr. Thank you, Tennessee Chapter, for organizing this. I love to come to these events, especially over. It's so knowledgeable that he's written all these books and I just can't quite get my arms around the fact that he's an American history and that it's a watershed. You know, in United States history, we get up to the Civil War and then we get after the Civil War. And in between time, there's an inordinate amount of attention and discussion and argument and analysis of that little thin slice of history. That's how the trail of tears. hundred people were there, a very thin, which a number of Cherokee uh, executed this. It was in direct contradiction of Cherokee law, and they knew it was. 
the leader of the group, often the group called the Treaty Party or the Ridge Party, Major Ridge himself was responsible for it being laid down in written law that the blood law, which was an ancient Cherokee law, but he put it in writing and stirred up the Cherokee Nation to be very adamant. We're not giving up any more land and nobody's going to sign any land away without the consent of the council. There will be no more of this run over here and get some uh, uh, town chief drunk and bribe him and give him and his brothers some reservation.